All right, here is my nitric acid machine. So, this is where the air goes in into my uh, jar and then the air gets sucked out on that side which comes into the water distilled water that I made this morning. Oh yeah, there's some blood there. Um, I don't know why I put a filter there. <laughs> I just had it. Um, that comes around to my vacuum pump which is from a Chrysler Focus made in Mexico uh, that's powered by a 12 volt DC uh, power supply sorry for the shakiness um, here we have 15 kilovolt transformer from a neon sign so, um, this is Luke. Hey, buddy. So, come on, let's go. Science time. First, we'll start off by turning on the transformer. Uh, you can see, getting a pretty good arc there. Um, if I leave this on for a few minutes, the jar actually starts to turn like a dark brown kind of yellowy uh, I could let you see that but uh, kind of stinks uh, I'd rather have it being kind of run through the water here so um, I'll go ahead and switch this on and I think this pump must work on a must have an internal vacuum switch or something seems to uh, Seems to kind of run and then shut itself off. I don't know. I'm not sure it's going to work the best for me. Um, yeah, kind of weird. There we go. So you can see it's moving quite a lot of air. Um, and actually, when it kicks on, you'll see the arc starts to move as the air flows through the arc chamber, which is kind of cool. Um, it's also kind of cool because it maybe gives it a little bit of time to react. Um, probably not as important, but uh, I decided to go with the vacuum route instead of with an air pump, um, just because I thought it might help the nitrogen dissolve into the water better if it's under lower pressure again like I said it's probably you know probably not much more efficient but uh, the truth is I didn't have a, a little air pump but I did have a vacuum pump and I thought this would work pretty good so um, the blue hose I'm using uh, it's just fuel hose I'm not sure that it's gonna be uh, okay uh, once the solution does become acidic um, I guess we'll find out <laughs> it's kinda again it's all I had so um, yeah we're gonna see if this works uh, anyways it's starting to smell a bit in here like ozone and stuff so I'm gonna kick the fan on and uh, I got the window open so <laughs> yeah let's see thanks for watching